Welcome to the Tail Slate. I'm Ben Stacy, and this is Carly Power, and we are watching Doctor Who. We are watching Boomtown now. Um, Boomtown is one I I like. It's it's kind of light and a little cheesy, mm -hmm. but there's some elements about it I really really like. It's a fun one. So let's just uh, let's just watch. Excited Here we go. <laughs> from inside Downing Street. Do you remember the Slovene? So we are yeah. getting even more new arrivals. Obviously, Mr. Cleaver, you're the expert. Then you'll stop it. Seems I have no choice. And what was this lady's knee? Oh, <laughs> do excuse me. Civic duties leave little time for a sandwich. But you promise you'll stop it today? Well, of course. Nothing is more important than human life. What do you take me for? Some sort of maniac? Why, no. Am I right in thinking you've shown your results only to me? Just to you. No one else. Wise move. I can't tell you, Mrs. Vay, this is such a weight of my mind. I barely slept. I couldn't believe my own readings. The scale of it. Destruction like the British Isles has never seen before. If I didn't know better, I'd almost think that someone wanted this project to go wrong. As though they intended this city should be wiped off the map. Thank goodness we got you, our esteemed leader. <laughs> So this is in the center of Cardiff in Wales. They filmed Doctor Who in Wales, in Cardiff. That's where they're based. And uh... who the hell are you? What do you mean? Who the hell am I? Who the hell are you? Captain Jack Harkness. Whatever you're selling, we're not buying. Get out my way! Tell me, this must be Mickey. And it's an important location for other stuff. It's Mickey. Don't listen to him. He's one in your way. You look fantastic. Oh, sweet. Look at these two. How come I never get any of that? Buy me a drink first. Such hard work. But worth it. Did you manage to find it? There you go. I can go anywhere now. I told you you don't need a passport. It's all very well going to Platform 1 and Justice Year and the Glass Pyramid of San Clean, but what if you end up in Brazil? I might need it. You see, I'm prepared for anything. That sounds like you're staying in. Well, what did he think if she wanted her passport? <laughs> So what are you doing in Cardiff? And who the hell's jumping Jack Flash? I mean, I don't mind you hanging out with big ears up there. Oi! Look in the mirror. But this guy, I don't know, he's kind of... Handsome? More like cheesy. Early 21st century slang. Is cheesy good or bad? It's bad. But bad means good, isn't that right? You say I'm not answer. We just stopped off. <laughs> we need to refuel. Baby, stare it. Probably wondering what four people can do inside a small wooden box. <laughs> <laughs> what are you captain of? The innuendo squad. Wait, uh, the TARDIS, you can't just leave it, doesn't it get noticed? Yeah, what's with the police box? Why does it look like that? It's a cloaking device. It's called a chameleon circuit. The TARDIS is meant to disguise itself wherever it lands, like if this was ancient Rome, it'd be a statue on a plinth or something. But I landed in the 1960s, it disguised itself as a police box, and the circuit got stuck. So it can't be the real thing, there actually was police boxes? Yeah, on street corners. Phone for help before they had radios and mobiles. If they arrested somebody, they could shove them inside till help came, like a little prison cell. Why don't you just fix the circuit? I like it, don't you? I love it. But well, that's what I meant. There's no police boxes anymore, so doesn't it get noticed? Ricky, let me tell you something about the human race. You put a mysterious blue box slap bang in the middle of town. What did he do? Walk past it. Now stop your nagging. Let's go and explore. <laughs> What's the plan? I don't know. Cardiff, early 21st century, and the wind's coming from the east. But from what I can make out, Cleaver was saying that the whole project could go up worse than Chernobyl. Something wrong with the night. Oh, they're always on the blink. I can't tell you how many memos I've sent. Then you're going to print this information. Are you alright? You sound a sore throat. <laughs> Just a little tickle. But tell me, do you intend to make this information public? I have to. So be it. And your boyfriend thinks I'm mad. We're getting married next month. He says if I cause a fuss, I could lose my job. Just when I need the money. 
boyfriend. Jeffrey. Civil servant. He's nothing exciting, but he's mine. When's the wedding? The 19th. It's really just to stop my mother from nagging, but the baby sort of clinched it, I suppose. You're with the child? Three months. It's not showing yet. It wasn't planned. It was an accident. Nice accident, though. Congratulations. Thank you. How about you? You got any kids? No. Is there a Mr. Blaine? Not anymore. I'm all on my own. Aww. I had quite a sizable family once upon a time. Wonderful brothers. Oh, they were bold. So ugly, it's cute, kind of. <laughs> yeah, their eyes close the other way. That's so weird. Six weeks, 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 See the Lord Mayor. Have you got an appointment? No, nope, just an old friend passing by, a bit of a surprise. Can't wait to see her face. Well, she's just having a cup of tea. Just go in there and tell her the doctor would like to see her. The doctor who? Just the doctor. Tell her exactly that. The doctor. I'm gonna take you. Says, thank you for, for popping by. She, she'd love to have a chat, but um, she's up to her eyes and paperwork. Perhaps if we could make an appointment f for next week. She's climbing out the window, isn't she? Yes, she is. destroy this entire planet. Apart from that. So, you're a Slovene. You're on Earth. You're trapped. Your family get killed, but you teleport out just in the nick of time. You have no means of escape. What do you do? You build a nuclear power station. But what for? How do you think of the name? What? Blaise Droog? It's Welsh. I know, but how did you think of it? Chose it at random, that's all. I don't know. Just sounded good. Does it matter? Bly Throog. What's it mean? Bad Wolf. But I've heard that before. Bad Wolf. I've heard that lots of times. Everywhere we go, two words following us. Bad Wolf. How can they be following us? Nah, just a coincidence. Like hearing a word on the radio, then hearing it all day. Never mind. Things to do. The family Slovene was tried in its absence many years ago and found guilty, with no chance of appeal. According to the statutes of government, the moment I return, I have to be executed. What do you make of that, Doctor? Take me home, and you take me to my death. Not my problem. Since you're taking me to my death, that makes you my executioners. Each and every one of you. You deserve it. You're very quick to say so. You're very quick to soak your hands in my blood. It treats you better than me how, exactly? That's the one with the light on. Two bedrooms, Bayside View. I was rather condemned. I suppose I'll see it again. Suppose not. Yeah. Tell me then, Doctor, what do you know of our species? Only what I've seen. Did you know, for example, in extreme cases, when her life is in danger, 
A female Raxacoric phallopatory manufactured a poison dart in her home finger. Yes, I did. Just checking. And one more thing. Between you and me. nice that at the end she turned into an egg it was a cool one and she was right when she was telling the doctor you know she had the, doc the doctor pegged mm -hmm. like you know how many times have you been executioner or mm -hmm. or left or left people you know mm -hmm. and it's true it, it that's why it was sort of working on him i think yeah but here's the thing i guess it is better than killing her having her regress back to the egg but basically that that margaret that lived doesn't exist anymore yeah yeah she's gone <laughs> so essentially one. that margaret's dead mm -hmm. this yeah. is a brand new one so yeah, that was kind of cool <laughs> i think um i don't know i think mickey we'll probably see him like maybe once or twice again or but i think he's finally starting to realize that rose is always going to choose the doctor yeah, poor mickey poor mickey <laughs> yeah yeah 
So now we're coming down to the the final stretch. There's a couple more episodes left mm -hmm. this season. So yeah. Yeah, looking forward to those. Mm -hmm. So that was Boomtown. Hope you enjoyed us watching it. <laughs>